if you shave your day. How y'all doing really? Hopefully you're doing pretty good because I'm doing pretty good too. Now, did you miss me? <laughs> I was going to do a review on Wednesday because I'm trying to get more content out there, but I was just, work just really kicked my ass and I'm like, man, I don't want to throw a video together. It's just like, so yeah, wait till the weekend and I'm like, okay, I'm a day off. I'm going to sleep in a little bit. Got all my stuff prepared. Hopefully I got it all prepared and yeah, we're going to rock out a video today. So yeah, and you're why you had a Detroit Red Wings? We'll get into that in a minute. Well, you gotta watch the whole video. You can't watch the first five minutes of it. If, I, if I'm that boring, then whatever. Anyways, so, he's ready for the title. Camp Phoenix, Phoenix Shavings first in-app only release, exclusive release. What does that mean, Chris? Well, Phoenix Shaving actually has their own app now. So, the app that everyone's talking about, available for Android and iOS. So, what you gotta do, <clears throat> smartphone, Apple or Android, Google Play, Apple Store. Don't type in, look up the app, don't type in Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. No, just type in Phoenix Shaving. Download the app and turn your notifications on. Very, very important. And uh, Douglas and Fran, they're doing this thing now to where you can only get, you can't go to the website. You go to the website, you're going to miss out. You have to have the app on your phone to get these exclusive deals. They're going to come out with more stuff. I don't know because I'm not getting into mind to Douglas because, yeah, it dude's way ahead of, her, ahead of everybody. So, yeah. Now, the first, this is the very first thing that they came out with for uh, first in-app only exclusive release. And that is Camp Phoenix. Yeah, Camp Phoenix. First 50 bundles got the uh, holographic label. CK6. Oh, yeah. A lot of people already got this and checked this out, but I'm going to do a YouTube video on it because you know how I roll. So, yeah. This is the very first exclusive. I got a sticker I got. Got this a while ago. So, anyway. Um, what else am I going to say? I got a lot to say. Okay. First 50 funnel holographic label. This is where it's getting all written, but you got to listen. Scent profile on the soap. A magical campfire containing the essence of blood orange and raspberry with pronounced notes of smoky cedarwood, birch, balsam fir, nutmeg, and allspice. Scent profile aftershave. Different. Same but different, and they tie together. I don't know if they've ever done something like this before. If, you, if they have, comment below and tell me, because I've never noticed they've done something like this before. Cologne is the sweet tears of a freshly created fireside s'more, crispy, wholesome graham cracker, melted milk chocolate, and hot, sticky, toasted marshmallow. A nostalgic and buttery blend of cinnamon, allspice, milk chocolate, benzoid, tonga bean, no, tonka and vanilla bean. What do you mean, dude? This smells like a campfire. This smells like freaking toasted marshmallows. Straight up. That's exactly what it is. Two different scents, but they fit together. I don't know how the hell Douglas might freaking did that. So yeah, campfire, toasted marshmallow s'mores. Crazy, right? Yeah, but we're shaving with it today, so check it out. <clears throat> now, you guys think this is an unobtainium? It's not an unobtainium from about what I'm about to read. You're like, oh, I missed out on it. I'm never going to get it again. It's unobtainium. No, 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 no. What is Camp Phoenix? Or better still, where is Camp Phoenix located? Answer, anywhere it wants to be at any given moment. That's the beauty of being a phantom, supernatural, paranormal summer camp. So it's going to come back next summer. Another overlooked benefit is the sheer quality of the ghost stories told around the nightly campfires. Then there is the all-star cast of camp counselors. Nessie, Bigfoot, Dogman, Mothman, Aliens, Lost Dutchmen, Skinwalkers, <whistles> etc. <clears throat> location, location, location. Luckily, today's location happens to be within the digital wilderness of the official Phoenix Shaving app. That's how you had to get it. Making this drop our first in-app only exclusive release. All this making Camp Phoenix, Phoenix doubly special, so welcome campers. And may you all enjoy the, your limited time here. It's true, the clock is a ticking. So be sure to tell your friends to install our app ASAP. So you get the app. It's only on the app. You can't go to the website and get it. Phoenix Shaving. Don't type in Phoenix Dungeon Accoutrements. Anyways, that's all the talking, shaving. Why you got the Detroit Red Wings on there? Well, got a lot, man. <laughs> this week on BBS Live, mate, <laughs> Nick, Nate and Mel... The, week, the shape or the theme of the week is sports week. So Mel said, we're your favorite sports team. Put in hashtag sports week, comment below. So yeah, I'm representing these guys too. So my favorite team, 
And, well, you're not wearing it, Chris. You'll see. If we talked about all the Detroit Red Wings stuff I have, I'd make an hour-long video. So I'm just using this one. And who do you got, Chris? Who do, well, who, who do you think I got? Stevie, eyes are playing. One of my favorite underrated captains. Oh. And I'm wearing, that I'm wearing, glass banger shirt, Gordy Howe, Mr. Hockey. Oh yeah, representing my favorite team. <laughs> Hopefully they come back and they do good. So let's get into the shade. We're talking about Phoenix, Camp Phoenix. Now, Camp Crystal Lake, Camp Crystal Lake actually has a Jason. What does Camp Phoenix have? Don't go in the water because we got La Creature on there. What? Yeah, we'll get you in the lake. Don't go in the water and don't go sneaking off into the woods having sex because guess what? You got Phantom Blue, you got El Phantasma, and you got the Crimson Ghost too. So don't around. Yeah, so that's what we're using today. La Creature. Yeah. Creature ain't got nothing on Jason Voorhees. Jason Voorhees ain't got nothing on Clear. You know what I'm trying to say. Ah, so what we're going with. Going with the whole green thing, kind of. Jeanette, seven, Jeanette. Yeah, we're going with Jeanette. Jeanette, seven o'clock greens. All right. Doo -doo 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 -doo. How y'all doing today? Got the day off. I'm going to upload this. Got some stuff to do. Got a pack weekend. All right. So, Jeanette, seven o'clock. Put that in there in the top cap. I'm jamming in there. Set this on top. And just let it, let that crank down. It's gonna snap soundy, but that's normal. So just be very careful with it. Don't go cranking it in there. Good, we're in there. She's it. She's in there, Captain. Cap. Captain, my captain. <laughs> All right. So brush we're gonna be using today. We are using Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. Phoenix shaving. The the Green Ray 24 millimeter. Synthetic brush, triple synth, not. Now, I'm going to do something. I do this off camera, but <laughs> lather and stuff. I'm going to do something I haven't ever done to a Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements soap before. I'm going to actually scoop it. Because that looks really good. I want you guys to see this. And I'm going to probably scoop out this little nug right here. Nug. <laughs> I'm going to put it in the bowl. Yeah, I'm going to scoop it this time. I'm going to try to scoop it. Scoop it up into the bowl, and I'm going to lather it that way. And I'll be right back, and I'm going to scoop it with this base. Final Frontier. Just kidding. Yeah, base pick, scooper from Phoenix Shaving. So, let's get this all ready, lathered up. Appreciate we're going to be going with this. If you're in a camp, you know, you don't want to bring the whole cube, right? We're going to go with two. Yeah, very good travel size for going camping. Be right back. All right, I'm back. Yeah. Get this wild up. Hot water. Hot water on the face. Yeah. All right. Tube and a cube, cube and a tube, cube and a tube. Free shave, mentholated. Yeah, <coughs> sorry, mentholated. I don't think you'd really want to bring the real big cube if you're going camping, right? <laughs> Gotta put it in a plastic bag. Sure, it doesn't get all too wet and sit on the counter, blah, blah, blah. It's easy, pack it away. Let it sit on the counter for a little bit. Good to go. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. That's what we're doing. That's what we're going. That's what we're going with this. That's my story. I'm thinking to it. Yeah. Now I got. Let's see. It would tomorrow would be exactly seven days worth of growth. So this is six days. Oh. Yeah, I'm good. Imagine accepting the truth. I didn't even listen to that Limp Bizkit song this morning, man. Oof, so heavy. You guys are Limp Bizkit fans? I like Limp Bizkit with West Borland. Didn't like him without West Borland's like the meat. He's West Borland makes that band. All right, so scooped it out with my uh, base pick. And you can see how much I barely took just a little bit, not even in an almond size, because CK6, you don't need much. And very watery, thirsty, so mix this up a little bit. Yeah, probably need a little bit more water in there, but you guys know how I don't use it. But that's 
That's what that produced. Like that little tiny bit. You don't need much CK6. That should last you a long freaking time. Now there's like debate, like people like CK6 one or CK1 better than CK6. CK6 is slick. I could see why it costs a little bit more. CK1 is still good though. I mean, you could lather up Liggity Split. Liggity Splickity 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 Sliggity Liggity. Be rabbit. Anyway, yeah, let's get the shave going, dude. Boom. A little bit, of, a little bit on there. Ah, oh, yeah. Six days worth of growth. Mm -mm -mm. Got some cool movies coming out. I'm a Keanu Reeves fan. I see the new, there's a new Matrix trailer. I saw that, I was like, oh yeah. Taking it back. Hope it's pretty good. The trailer looked pretty dang good for the new Matrix movie. I know there's a John Wick 4 coming out. Yeah, Keanu's cool. Usually not that many good movies. Like, that really sparked me. I'm gonna watch Fast 9, but I'm not like, oh, Fast and Furious 9, yeah! I'm like, I'll check it out. But, yeah. Oh, look at that. Very, very nice. Very good. Yeah. Flipping campfire. Now, me personally, if you have this, your mileage may vary. It's my own personal opinion. I think this soap would go really good with uh, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrement Fireworks. The July, 4th of July uh, scent. I think they would pair and match really well. Except that's more gunpowder forward, or gunpowdery forward, I guess you could say. Like fireworks, spit fireworks. Well, this is like a campfire. But it smells really, 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 really good. So. Alright, razor, pass one. Light pressure with this razor. Don't need much pressure. Now, oh, so you guys seen I used that cartridge razor last video, right? I didn't get no nicks, I didn't get no bumps, I didn't get no razor burn or nothing like that. That's not a bad cartridge. If I had to be a cartridge shaver, I mean, I'm not gonna knock cartridges, but if I had to, I would pick that one. Doesn't have 25 million blades on it. It's got two blades. I still don't like that moisturizing strip. Let me see. Sure you go. Yeah, see, it's, I'm not a fan of that. Cause it said Gillette, this always gets all mucked up. But the blade and the shave was not bad. I just don't, I'm not a fan of the moisturizing strip on those. All right, let's get to this shave. Yeah, a creatura. Creature from the Black Lagoon. Creature from the Phoenix Shaving Lagoon. Right? <laughs> oh yeah, you can smell. Man, it's campfire. <laughs> Smells good. Camp Phoenix. Camp Phoenix. Like I said at the beginning, don't type in Phoenix Artisan Accoutrement. Type in Phoenix Shaving, because Phoenix Shaving is all of it. You got Phoenix Shaving is Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. It's the, uh, oh, I can't think off the top of my head real quick. Crown King, that's Phoenix Shaving. It's all Phoenix Shaving. So Phoenix Artisan Accoutrement is not the main thing. Like when you go looking on, even on the website, you look on the website, you don't type Phoenix Artisan Accoutrum, Accou, uh, uh, yeah, it's too confusing. Just type in Phoenix Shaving, even on the website. What comes up? Bam! All of it. I'm wondering what the next thing is going to be. <laughs> what like the next in app thing is going to be. Very light, light, light. Sorry, I ain't speaking, I'm trying to concentrate a little bit. Ah, uh, enjoy the shave. 
Nice, nice, nice. Look at that, the second pass. All right, I'm good, yeah. Get that second pass going. Imagine accepting the drum. Man, Biscuit was awesome back in the day, man. First freaking Family Values Tour, Family Value Tour 98. Yeah, Corn, Limp Biscuit, Romstein, and Ice Cube. Oh, man. Um, past two. Corn was the headliner. But when Limp Biscuit came out, this was at Phoenix. Where was that at? That's two. Veterans Memorial Coliseum. If you're, in, if you're familiar with uh, Phoenix, it's the one, it's the Coliseum that looks like a Pringles chip. When Limp Biscuit came out, I was in the top, I was right by the right side of the stage. I was in the top balcony so I could see the whole arena. When Limp Biscuit came out, it literally looked like a flipping waterfall of human beings just down into the pit. Just a waterfall of people. Bam! I'm like, I am not going down into that pit. I'm like looking, it's like a sea. I was like, man, these guys wasn't really a big fan of them because I don't know, they're too like pretty heavy for me, and they're like you know the whole heavy red old rap metal. And at the time, they had the Faith song. Oh, I guess it would be nice. And I'm like, I'm not really digging these guys, but they grew on me. And I'm like, man, these guys are cool. I didn't get it at the time, but now I'm like, wow, heavy and West Borland. Oh my God, that guy is so artistically creative. His outfits, his suits, his seven string guitar. The way he plays, the way he does is quiet and loud. Yeah, he's amazing. Les Borland's awesome. Uh, yeah, we're good. This is a mustache. Just think about it. Boom, ba -ding, boom, ba -da -da -boom. Just think about it. Oh, kitty, you scared me. He's in the bathtub sleeping. That's what cats do in Arizona because it's so hot. Gillette 7 o'clock green. Ooh. 7 o'clock black's good too, man. That's a nice, sharp, smooth. Ooh. Could be a daily driver blade. What do we got here? No nicks, no cuts, no weepers. Hey, right, clean up and right back. Just waking up, taking up, waking up. Gotta thank God. I don't know what the day seems kind of odd. No barking from the dog. No smog. And we got a good shave on. Yeah. <laughs> Today was a good shave. Boop. Oh my god dang, that was good. Yeah, look at that, smooth. Very, very good. No nicks, no cuts, no weepers. Good God, I'll wet my slate now. A good God, I'm playing for days now. A good God, a purple haste now. Dude, I know a lot of music, dude. <laughs> anyway, oh, I unlock. Before we get to the after shave. You know what? Yeah, I unlock. Oh, I'm gonna do the whole face. Yeah. 
This is good for if you got acne prone skin too. So, you can rub your whole face with this stuff. It's good. Alum. For all my, for all my uh, subscriber friends overseas, aluminium. I know some Americans say it weird. Aluminum. It's aluminium. <laughs> Even Canada says aluminium. I think. You guys say aluminium in Canada? I know Australia and New Zealand does. Uh, New England, too. No, not New England. England, UK. Aluminium. Okay, there we go. <laughs> aftershave we're going to be using today. Phoenix Shaving, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, Aftershave and Cologne. Very, very cool, cool looking label. Yeah. I've heard a couple people had a reaction to this. I hope I don't, because, yeah. Toasted marshmallows. We'll see, though. I'll be honest with you guys. I'll tell you on my next video if I had a reaction to it or not. Because it might be right away. It might be later, but let's see. Toasted freaking... Oh, my good God. Wow. But there's more. There's more. <laughs> there's more than just marshmallow. Where is it? Melted chocolate, sticky, toasted marshmallow, nostalgic, and buttery blend of cinnamon, allspice, milk chocolate, benzoin tonka, and vanilla bean. Yeah, that does burn a little bit. I don't have a reaction, but yeah, that does. Like the Ken Surfs. Ah! Maybe it's the cinnamon. I don't know. Yeah, it burns a little bit. But, yeah. Boom. All right. Recap of what we used today. Yeah, that burns. <laughs> we used Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, Phoenix Shaving, Aftershave, and Cologne, Camp Phoenix. We also used PA, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, Tube 2.0, Epic Pre-Shave Soap. PA on block. You real eye on drugs. The Green Ray 24 millimeter synth Phoenix shaving brush. Trouble synth, trouble with tribbles. They're like they're like rabbits. They breed. Ooh. Razor reuse. PA La Criatura. Razor first use seven o'clock green. Very good. Very smooth. Yeah. And it burns a little bit, but it's like subsiding now. So, hmm. I don't know. I'll tell you guys next video. And we oh, have a little sticker. No sticker. The main one today, Phoenix Shaving, Camp Phoenix. Real cool, if you look close, you can see the uh, Bigfoot, he's got his eyes, he's like, <laughs> you can see him, yeah, you can see his eyes in there. Heiserman, yeah. That, and I barely, I barely, barely used just a tiny, tiny, like it was literally like that much, not even an almond size, and it produced a really, really, really good lather, so. Yeah, the burn's going away. Little red. But, yeah. Anyways, that's the shave of the day. Oh, also, get the app. If you want to try and get exclusive stuff like this that you can only get through the app, not on the website, you got to get the app. So, that's the shave of the day, ladies and gents. So, hope you ladies and gents have a good day, good week, good shaves. More to come, and see you ladies and gents soon.